Hello? Hello? Yes. It's not too bad. <sighs> I was quite surprised at how many uh, goodies I found in one <coughs> fishing expedition. Yeah, that did seem quite a little run there. Yeah, it was all like from, <clears throat> I don't know, like 10 boxes or something. And like all items that were useful, but they're all like, a lot of them are level 44 or something. So yeah, I mean that 19 agility on the chest is male as well, it's pretty huh. good. Yeah, I suppose, so that was level 39, well, 39. I you can't use it until 40, but... Yeah. Um, yeah, I don't know what, I haven't looked at what, um, what gear you can, like, what, I haven't really looked at hunter gear, to be honest. I've looked a little bit at druid gear. Um, yeah, Hunter Gear is, in a weird way, like, surprisingly hard to come by. Is it? In terms of, it didn't seem like there was any kind of obvious... I made a bank character, I'm just running into Stormwind. Um, yeah, like, Scarlet Monastery is pretty bad. Yeah. It's actually pretty bad for all of us. Well, it's, it's not yeah. bad for me, I suppose, but... It's like a fun um, instance, isn't it? But And it's like... Yeah. It's it's good XP. But it actually the loot... Kind of warrior or caster. Yeah. Yeah. yeah, all the mail is like strength warrior gear, but then the warriors come out of Scarlet Monastery kind of hitting 40, wanting to switch to plate. Yeah, that's true. Yeah. So it's sort okay. of an odd, an odd spot. Um, See, so yeah, I don't think the gear really picks up for me until kind of Zolfarak, Alderman, Sunken Temple, you know? Right, okay. But, but I mean, I, you know, I can still wear like rogue gear, you know, leather. Yeah, I'll, I'll have to have a look at some point and see what, because um, the item finder, or just the item search in, um, oh wow, which one is it? Oh, wow. I had, yeah. Yeah, it's really good. Yeah, yeah. <clears throat> I had a kind of a brief look through it the other day. And I was kind of amazed by <coughs> a lot of the... It's like a quite a good um, male agility set, but it's crafted. Oh, is it well, yeah, leatherworking? Yeah, and I was looking at it going like, I should have gone leatherworking. Oh, <laughs> <laughs> uh, well. Because I haven't really made I the most of engineering yet, you know? Yeah, well, whatever you choose is going to be difficult. I suppose with leatherworking, it's kind of... Oh, actually, leatherworking would have been great because of all the fishing we've been doing. I've, I've had so much leather that mm. I've sold. Same with um, tailoring stuff. I've, I've just been... <laughs> I've, I've given Ben a certain amount and then I've just been selling everything, <laughs> even though I'm sure it's useful. Oh, well, the, to be honest... Just greedy. <laughs> yeah, but the gold, the gold, even just like farming the gold, so we have like enough to buy the yeah. two mounts that we need at level 40 is... Well, that's kind of what I was thinking, really. Time well spent, think, thank you very much. <laughs> that's all right. Yeah, no, I'm, I'm happy to go to it, because every now and then, that like a really nice green drops mm. for one of us, and it helps so much in the dungeons, so... Um, yeah, like I'm wearing a couple of pieces that you sent me. They're, yeah, I've they're got quite few, big upgrades. I've, I've got a few because I've been doing the material boxes quite a lot. I've got a few items that are just in the bank waiting for me to get to forty something. Uh, what were we actually doing? So I got every quest I possibly could in Strangthorn <laughs> just to see what was what. Okay. Um, I don't know whether it's. I'll share some of them if we go anywhere near. The yeah, okay. I'm just, I'm on my bank. I'm gonna send myself back some engineering. I'm gonna engineer with whatever materials I've got and then think okay. about what to do. It's like, if if those mobs we need to kill are like quite high level, then we, I guess the three of us could go over to Desolus and just knock out that, that quest if we want to do it at like level 38 or something. We could do. I've it might be worth us just doing it individually in yeah. our own time because we're, we're not going to be able to do white main before level 30 well what level is white main i can't remember 42 they're both 42 42 okay 
So we're going to need to be at least like 38, 37, probably. Probably, yeah. I mean, it would be amazing if we could can kill them both at level 36. Yeah. I wonder if it, the thing is, you've got to kill both at the end, haven't you? So that'd be fucking hard. Because she reses him and then they both fight him. Yeah, yeah. Yeah, I wonder how we do that. Because you can't crowd control them at all. No. Well, the fight's getting quite fun now. Yeah, I mean, I yeah, I don't know. I wonder. I could take, I could take, like, um. Maybe I should go and do that. I should go and tame a, um. A turtle. <laughs> because they've got this, like, shield wall ability, you know? So you just put the pet on one, yeah. shield wall it, and just leave it while we try and kill the other. Kill the other, you know? It does seem pretty good, the, um, the turtle. I was watching some of that, that mm. dwarf back, what, depths run. Yeah. He had a turtle. And yeah. He did pretty well tanking various level 60 elites. Like, I don't think the threat will be very good unless no. I spec but Beast Beastmaster. Bad. No, exactly, that's what I'm saying. It only has to keep threat off the healing. Yeah. If I'm hitting it, I really want to be Beastmaster spec, but um, if it's just like to off tank and add. Yeah. You know, we lose on pet damage, but then my pet damage isn't actually that much of my damage. I don't think. Because I'm marks anyway, you know? It's just a. Uh an extra little uh, like an dot. extra dot, yeah. But if it's um, like most of the pets are reasonably fast attacking, and with Seal of Light, they seem to like Pedro is the, the one who benefits from Seal of Light the most. Oh, yeah, just topping himself up. <laughs> yeah. I'll tell you what, I could do actually is go and get my first aid manuals. Ah, uh, yeah, I think that's what I might well, I mean, I can now. get I can get them at some point and send them to you if you want. Yeah, but I mean, I'm just talking about like this time now while Ben isn't on. I'm going to do my. Oh, I see. Yeah, sure. Yeah. I've got ahead. so much silk cloth. Have you? Absolutely loads of it. I haven't. I'm. I'm. I haven't. I've made like four silk bandages. Oh, I see. You've been storing it all up for for bandaging, have you? Yeah, and then I'm going to sell the excess or uh, give the excess off to to Ben. Yeah, I think he's fairly close to. Mage weed now, anyway. Yeah, it's worth it. I mean, I can, I can make you bandages if you if you want some. Oh, that's all right. I've got so much cloth. I can just I just make myself like a couple, and then use them and make another couple and use them. You know. Yeah, fair enough. Have you are you on to heavy then? Heavy silk. I maxed. I maxed. I need to go and get the silk bandage uh, trailer. Is that oh, of course. Yeah, sorry. Yeah. So actually, no. Wait. Yeah, no. So silk is what you get up to, isn't it? With the thing. Yeah. So I've got heavy, heavy wool. So I really need to go and train the silk bandages. Okay. Hello. Oh, hello. 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 Hi. How you doing? You right? Yeah. How you doing? Good. I'm gonna try and make some bombs. Shall I make an explosive sheep? <laughs> yes, please. <laughs> I'm just gonna listen to that. Because <laughs> to listen to what? I'm gonna make some bombs. <laughs> <laughs> Have you got iron yet? Iron yeah, 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 iron yeah, grenades. yeah. Oh, oh, nice. oh no, not iron grenades. Oh, okay. Right, inventory's full. Okay, I've got the materials to make. Some sheep. Let me just. I should, I should probably head up to. Are we? What are we doing? I'll stop fishing. Yeah. Well, are you? Are you on playing now, Ben? Yeah, I'm just loading up. Cool. Oh man, I've got so much junk. Do you know, like when I did my last, because I've streamed everything, when I last logged in on my own just to do some engineering. Um, I spent like 90 minutes just engineering. <laughs> Ridiculous. It's, it's, I've just stopped, you know, recording any of anything other than instances. Yeah. It seems I, a bit pointless. Well, I, I want to do like a complete, 
I want to do like a video, one video that's the whole playthrough. Oh, okay. Yeah, fair enough. Yeah, you're just gonna do it at uh, like a uh, super fast speed or something. No, just leave it just, real time. Just an entire. Yeah. Are you? Are you... Yeah. <laughs> What, an entire... if, if it if I can get it downloaded and cut and export so your whole yeah. play like basically the entire thing played. yeah <laughs> yeah five yeah. days if solid. YouTube if YouTube takes it yeah I'll do it yeah like f f 500 hour long video Fuck it that'd be funny <clears throat> I don't know what the maximum length of video like, is I've on seen, YouTube the only ones I've seen have been like 10 hours of <clears throat> Nyan Cat like <laughs> yeah. Same, same thing. Ten hours. Right, I am going. Uh, have you seen the cut of Lord of the Rings, where every time Sam takes a step, <clears throat> and it says oh. it cuts to the bit where he says, uh, "This is the furthest, furthest I've <laughs> been away from like... Frodo, Mr. Frodo." <laughs> <It's> <laughs> That's really good. Every time he, he takes a step, and then it goes back to that for another minute, and then takes another step. Um, well, actually, the film flows quite nicely when he's not on camera, but then... I have seen the thumbnail and not clicked it. Yeah. I've, I've watched it for, like, like in sort of uh, weird enjoyment for about 20 minutes, and then I thought, this is ridiculous, I've got to yeah. stop. Okay, I'm making some explosive sheeps. I get an invite if you've got a group already. Oh, we, oh, we don't. Although it lasts for three minutes, I bet I can't actually use it. What do you mean? Well, because I've got a pet. Uh, no, no, it just runs at someone and blows up. Yeah, but it says it lasts for three minutes. I don't think that would be a problem as a hunter. Um, in mind do, I don't think so. Though. Well, it just made, runs I've... around like blows up. It's like a little companion. Okay. Uh, you can have a little cat. You can have like a parrot, can't you? Yeah. Yeah. It's just whether it gives you. I guess it doesn't give you the the pet bar, does it? That's because that's what caused problems before. And I remember I was trying to mind control the. Oh yeah. Oh no no. It's, not, it's, it's never near as clever as the uh, that thing. I don't think. Right, I'm just going to do a little bit of engineering, just make some bombs, and then I'm going to head up to um, Sky Monastery. Okay. Have you got that cloak already? Rich? Oh, what's that? Uh, yeah, I think he made. Yes, I do. Okay, cool. Uh, yeah, I found a few tailoring recipes, that, uh, tailoring items that would be really nice, but um, I don't think they're till 38 or something. Oh, okay. Uh, but the Dreamweave stuff is really nice, so. I'll send you loads of materials when I get to level 40. Oh, are you, uh, do you need any potions? Um, I don't think so. Looks like I've got lots of everything. Okay, cool. I'll need some elixir of agility at some point, but I've got three still, so... Okay. Oh, John, if you're near a bank, can you check for that true silver bar? Yes, I will do that. I'm not even sure that I gave you one, but just uh, just check it. So, if um, the other the alternative is if John can find or John mines any black vitriol, and then I can make a true silver bar from a mithril bar. Oh, sweet! That's one option. Oh, okay, that's cool. But and and that black pearl is going to be the hardest to find, isn't it? I I did have a little look at that. Like yeah, I'm hoping those uh, turtles and tenorists are still, they still drop the clams at the same rate as they did when that guy posted, because 1 in 30 is not too bad of a grind. Yeah, 
I got the impression the Murlocs in Dust Wallow were a bit better. I don't know really? though. I'm not sure. I'll have to check. I, I did have a look through like what drops giant clams and the drop rate. Oh, okay. And not, not, not giant, it's big mouth clams, isn't it? Because mm. um, I, <coughs> I need them anyway, because I need tangy meat or something, or whatever it is. Not tangy meat, zesty meat. Mm -hmm. um, but yeah, it sounded like it was. Uh, what was it? Like a couple of percent drop chance from a from a giant mouth clam. Mm. So it could be a bit of a grind. Let's see. Um, the golden pearl as well is mental. Oh yeah. So if you like, if you wanted to, like, if you're on a server like ours and you wanted to grind a, belt, a golden pearl, it would take you f forever. You just oh, really? uh, just rely have to rely on an auction house, I think. It was sort of hitting the point where the game is designed around there being an auction house and lots of players, yeah. aren't we? Yeah, exactly. Oh, the other, like, how are you going to get that made, though, Ben? If, do you have someone you can ask, then? Well, there's the no. guy that made me the last one, the gold rod. He seemed pretty good. He was level 60 paladin. Ah, and okay. um, he was really nice. And I've mailed him before, so I've actually said I'm going to send him a mail now and check to see if he can make it. I'm going to do that. Okay, cool. Nice one. I can't believe the... Um, I, was, I was just popped on it uh, just at the end of lunch like uh, 1.30 or something and then at 2 o'clock I, uh, I remembered that there was the, re the arena chest and ran down there um, and I was just on my own in the arena as the goblin you know walks out and plonks the chest down Right. and then I started opening it and I got sapped <laughs> 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 you're like what are the chances like this level skull night elf rogue <laughs> and he's just sort of like uh he just waited till I came out, and, uh, and I just did a cry, jumped on the chest, and did a dance for a while, and then he just slinked away. So I just <laughs> picked it up. <laughs> and he, like, she messaged, or he, she messaged me yeah, later yeah, and saying like, there wasn't a 16 slot bag in there, was there? Should have said yes. <laughs> <laughs> Troll. But yeah, that five stam trinket, I guess, is is uh, not bad for you, Ben. Mm-hmm. Yeah. That's pretty good. If, I have to go there. Have a, yeah, just I, I guess that on our server, you it's pretty bad luck to actually encounter someone. Yeah. yeah. It feels like a few more people are coming back from this server now. It, it does. does. Yeah. What, yeah. About? Uh, what we are to true silver bar. Yeah. I uh, got it. Oh, cool. Yeah, you can fish for the black pearls, and they're like every one in ten thousand will, will drop a black pearl. So. Yeah, one in ten thousand. Fuck that. Yeah, exactly. Oh, sick! I can learn goblin jumper cables. Oh, oh nice. fantastic! But I'm gonna make and try and make them. Iron bar, wearing bronze gizmo, oh, flask of oil. <laughs> Classic. I need two flask of oil. Should I, should I make them for next time, perhaps? Yeah, it's, it's very easy to get them for the harvesters, though. Isn't it? Yeah. Um, I'm at the auction house. Is there anything you want me to check for? Pearls. Oh, yeah, just see if there's any black pearls on there or. Uh, just, just do a search of everything and you're yeah, that's what I do. There's, there's, no... only, there's only ever two pages. That's oh, it. there's only yeah. one page. I've got. Is it peace bloom? No, there's linen cloth, leather, elixir of shadow power. Interesting. Uh, healing potion, nature potion, rage potion, a mace, some soul dust, a red mage weed bag. Is there any astral anyone on there? She sends anything on like that. No, and then some low-level herbs, and two large fang. <laughs> oh, actually, I need that. Um, <laughs> large fang. I, need, I need two large fang. Yeah, for really. Uh, no, I don't need it. I need it for something. It was a tailoring. Let me just find it. No, I think I may need that. 
because there was one item that would be useful, but it requires two large fang. I mean, how much are they? Are they ridiculous amounts? Six, six, probably... six silver. Uh... I can't believe that. Just, now. just search the whole auction house and you'll see everything. Yeah, this is ridiculous. Bad, isn't it? Some mage royal, some bright thorn, some bruise weed, mage weed bag, soul dust, green mace, rage potion, nature potion, defense potion, healing potion, a dagger, shadow pot. Yeah, I wouldn't worry. I think even with the last things thing, I think I'll, um, if I do need it, I'll go and okay. grind them. Right, I'm gonna, I've got enough to heavy stone to make ten bombs. I'm not sure what level you learn iron grenades. I can look on the trainer. What, 200 or something, is it? Is it 200? Grenades at one seven five. Really? Yeah. Is that what were you on? One six seven. Oh, I'm too far then. So no, not too far at all. I don't know when we can stop doing raise fen downs. Yeah, I just thought of that as a level forty instance, so I guess Yeah. A few levels time I think. We're probably in Scarlet Monastery for the next few levels really, aren't we? Yeah, I guess so. I think armory should armor will still be a push when it now, but um, Yeah, I'd like to give it a try. Oh yeah, definitely. We should be able to do it. It just but it'd be. Um, oh, be each instance of the bomb makes two to four. Ah, oh, nice. So it's not ten bombs. I've got okay. like thirty. Quite a few. Thirty-one bombs. Happy days. Nice. Oh, nice. I can use them fairly liberally then. Are they, which ones are those then? Which bombs are those? Um, they big, big, big iron bombs. Big or bronze, something? bronze bomb. So it's big a two-second stun. Okay. Yeah, I was w watching the um, watching the various calamities the other week, uh, the other day. Um, I think. Probably with the Mimerodons, it's probably best if we like wing clip them just before they get to 30 or or you can cast a shot them or something. And then Ben runs off and we just kill the other one, whatever else we've got. 
you know, like basically me and, me and you, John, finish them off while Ben kites them. Yeah, okay. So if they enrage at 30%, do they? Yeah. Yeah. They okay. just do so much damage, it's not worth like Ben being there. Or, otherwise, I've just got to spam heal. Yeah, okay. I, may, I guess we can attempt to put a stun on them as well. Yeah. It's un or is it unreliable, but worth a go. to make some very tasty fish. What kind? Um, she should be able to make some stuff that's like 12 stam soon. Well, actually I can make that now. Well, no, no I can. Yeah, basically soon, like with the fish, I think it's like 12 Sam stuff, 12, 12 Sam, 12 Spirit, and then some extra MP5 stuff as well. Um, there's some of them are a bit weird to fish though, because they're like, you have to fish at certain times of the day in Feralus. Looking for something specific? I imagine doing all this shit without the internet in 2005. Yeah. It's just insane. You yeah. just have to learn this stuff through word of mouth from the community. I think that's what made it so exciting though. Yes, it yeah. did. Yeah, absolutely. That's like why... There's so much mystery to it. And you just have what... to work it all out. That's why Dark Souls is so good. Yeah, I guess so. This um, Hades game is quite um, it's quite addictive. Oh yeah, what uh, is that? I don't know even what it is. It's sort of um, wait a minute. What's rogue like? What's that mean? What's rogue like as a game? I don't think it is the rogue like game. But... Don't know. <laughs> Because <laughs> I've like, heard, I said like my friend of mine said, um, he was explaining a game and he said it's a roguelike game and I said what is a roguelike game and he said do you even fucking play computer games? What? <laughs> what? <laughs> I think he was just like, I think he's sort of winding me up, but like yeah. apparently it's it's a well known genre. And I've, I've kind of heard of it before, but I didn't. I, didn't, I think it's like um, Assassin's oh, Creed. No, I, it's not like. Yeah, you know, not like a rogue, but it's a kind of. Here we go. It's rogue like is a subgenre of role-playing video games characterized by dungeon crawl through procedurally generated levels. Yeah, it's a rogue like then. Oh no, usually turn-based, grid-based movement, permanent death of the character. Yeah, so it's a bit like that, but it's um more kind of <coughs> Twitch, but a bit button bashy and Twitch. Kind of game, but your character progresses, so you, you you die and you repeat the run, trying to get further and further. Mm. And um, but the artwork and the dialogue and the voice acting is brilliant. Uh, the cool. graphics are really cool, and the character pro progression is quite nice because you you put it's much like Warcraft. You put talents in various things, and the mm. more resources you get, you can put talents in different abilities and unlock different weapons and different weapons uh, work well for certain enemies and not for others. Sounds like Diablo as well. Yeah, I was going to say it probably is a little bit. It's kind of, it's kind of, um, it's kind of isometric, I suppose. Do 
one is dead, he's dead. Oh, I'm gonna, I better start running because um, he'll be there before me. We inherited some old legacy code base today that uses an isometric framework called Chu. Isometric framework? Yeah. What the hell's that? Yeah, where they where I think it's re reactors an isometric. Oh, sorry, isomorphic. Oh, uh, isomorphic. Yeah. <laughs> it's like a three D three D framework. Yeah, I was like <laughs> isometric. That reminds me of the framework. It's that no isomorphic. There we go. Yeah, it's like yeah. a. Yeah, an isomorphic one called Chew, and it's a fucking nightmare. <laughs> it is a fucking nightmare. So, why I always get confused to why these sort of projects end up existing. It's like who made the choice to use this like really? So yeah, exactly right. It was a team of back end devs, no front end on the team, <laughs> right? Say no and more. <laughs> exactly, and what they decided, oh, let's make, let's do this in some of the hot new technologies that we can find, including something that's completely fun <laughs> like a functional framework. So it's all function, it's all functional style, yeah, yeah, patterns and everything. I quite like fun functional coding, but yeah, yeah, on. I haven't, I've just not experienced enough with it yet, but, but yeah, it's all like it just constantly is binding this to all kinds of things okay. all over the place and I'm like yeah. fuck <laughs> you <laughs> yeah and well, it I has didn't... like it has like a jQuery type syntax but it's not jQuery it's right like, okay oh my god <laughs> so everything's giant everything's a big object and it's just wrapping yeah and it's just this this like every few lines you see the word bind and it's like just <laughs> fuck off well, is it binders in their own method binders? Binders. Yeah, in... they've like made their own like class okay. or generator right. or something. Like, <laughs> I just don't have the will to learn it. Yeah. Yeah, I'm not surprised. Yeah, fun so functional programming really is the, it's the para it's the, <clears throat> the in vogue paradigm for JavaScript. In yeah. Stuff. Yeah. And it's it's actually quite nice. I much prefer it over object oriented programming personally but um I would like to skill up with some of those patterns and architectures. <laughs> I had to resist the urge to divine intervention people at random <laughs> moments. Really yeah. hard. I haven't made my jumper cables yet. <laughs> Sorry Ben but uh, so what did you so have you uh have you had to work on it or no, we just inherited it today, and there's like some discussion of whether we're just going to dump it and do a blue sky kind of new project and recreate everything that it does, right. or if we're going to try and Gre take a green it. Field. Yeah. You mean green field? Yeah. Well, okay. we, well, we, yeah, it's funny we actually use blue, blue, blue sky. sky. Blue sky thinking. Yeah. We're going to do some blue sky thinking and make a green field project. Yeah, I might bring that up actually because everyone, <laughs> we've all got kind of like acclimatised that phrase. It. Right? <laughs> That's a good point. It is. It is green field, isn't it? Um, so yeah. So yeah. Yeah. Like, I, yeah. Fuck it. I, I mean, it's I'm trying it's to. It's more fun to do as well. Like start again. <laughs> I, I've been trying to convince everyone that it's going to be less hassle to start again. But you know, all the all the backends like, oh no, it'd be way easier just to us for us to provide the data it needs. Just keep the current front end application. I'm like, ha ha ha! You haven't seen it yet. Yeah, that's the thing. Um, it, actually, I, I must say, like the initial, uh, <clears throat> I suppose I always have that initial desire to rebuild something because you, you have a clean slate, but often it does take so much longer than you think it will. I mean, I've, mm, I've no, yeah. no idea about your project, but um, we were talking, I remember at Wikudos, we were talking about rebuilding the whole thing. And um, I'm so glad we did it piecemeal because um, it was it would have been a huge huge like rebuild um, and yeah we um, time we would actually take an existing site use its layout and templating and then just create a new brand in because we have a, we have like an abstraction for our front end which is called our front end, front end toolkit where we have every brand defined as a as a bunch of configuration and we can take a bunch of templating and mm. say okay let's re rebuild this site call it something else and just change this configuration so that it's branded as it should oh, be okay um 
that's that's pretty nice. Yeah, it's really good. We've just hired a couple of design system people who like. Have you heard of like Hayden Pickering and Rob's uh, <laughs> Rob's Rob Stewart? Or I think his name's Rob. Yeah, Robert Stewart. Oh, yeah, oh, Rob Stewart. Rob Stewart. Um, <laughs> We hired Rod Stewart to be our <laughs> um, No, no, I've not heard of them, but they, they're sort of... Yeah, they're kind of uh, conference circuit people, and um, I think we've hired them as contractors to come in and have a look at our design system and give some feedback and try and take okay. on a big old project that we need doing as well, where something needs completely building from scratch. Ah, um, okay, cool. So it'd be interesting to see what they make of it. They've given really positive feedback so far, so it'd be really good. Okay, cool. Yeah, it must be nice to see some of them. Like, they're really good developers in action. See what they come up with. Mm. How's your um, coding stuff going, John? Have you done much yet? Uh, bits and pieces. I thought your, uh, your YouTube thing was really nice. YouTube oh, yeah. On Copen. My little, uh, yeah. Yeah, I mean, like, I just looked at, like, how do I do this? And sort of looked at someone's, like, blog post where they were talking about Flexbox. I like, give it a try. Okay. Yeah. Um, I think, um... Yeah, I was looking at Dice stuff. I want to make, like, a Dice app. That's oh, been, yeah. like, my thing. So, like, I'm going to break it down into stages. I want to make, like, I've been looking at just, you know, a JavaScript Dice, like, one single, a die, you know? But then do, I you, wanna... do you want to animate a, a dice? No, so like... no, I don't think so. I want it to produce the results. So, like, I want to use it okay. for, for Warhammer. So, they're like, there are often ah, okay, instances cool. where, like, you're like, okay, I'm going to roll 10, 10 dice for, like, an attack or whatever. Ah, and, I see. And I, I have a success of a three or more as a success, a hit. So, I want it to say, oh, roll, yeah, roll okay. 10 and then give all 10 results. Because then yeah, you can I do see. stuff like, you'll have abilities that will be, like, re roll all the ones. So you can like click a button that will say now re-roll all the ones. Ah, I see. Or like re-roll all the misses or whatever. So you can yeah. have like certain things and then you can be like and then there's like another step where you have to roll the wound. So it's like okay, take the successes, roll those. Then you have to like yeah. you've got like a four plus or whatever. It's like something that you can eventually put in, like, okay, I'm hitting on threes, re rolling ones, wounding on four, and it will just give you the result. Yeah, okay. So, like, build that up stage by stage, I think would be quite fun. Yeah, that's an interesting one because that's that's real kind of algorithm. Yeah, yeah I've been I've been like running it in my head, mm. and it's it's actually like more complicated than it, in it than it seems if you want to use it in the game. If you actually want to like rather than just say roll ten dice, what's the result? Like, I feel like that. Yeah, that's, that's one thing, and like to give the total is one thing, but then to give each individual result is like kind of something else. Yeah, yeah, absolutely. Like that's I don't know, good, like would you put that challenge to yeah, start with? Like would you put yeah. that in like an iterating thing that spits out a result one at a time? So so what explain exactly what you're trying to do again? So ten dice. So let's imagine you... rolling ten dice. Mm -hmm. I then want ten I want ten results back. Yeah. That's all. So you just say how many dice okay. do you roll? Put in the number and then it gives you that number of results. Yeah. Of between so just... one and six. Yeah. So I, I guess with with all these things, just break it down into constituent parts, the smallest constituent parts yeah. you can. So my first one yeah. is just roll one dice. Yeah. So I I yeah. make a dice rolling uh, yeah. function. Yeah. And so then I do that six times or ten right. times. So I've been I've been reading. I was reading. Spent some time the other day looking around that. I guess the, the bit I need to work out is like connecting the JavaScript to the like the display are. yeah 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 so are you, are you just doing it in you're just doing it i'll in just JavaScript do it and I'll just, well i haven't even started javascript yet but yeah i've, I've been looking at like other people's examples and, mm. and sort of like not wanting to like copy paste yeah do you know what i mean oh, it's, yeah write no, it's, it from it's scratch yeah it's it's definitely worth the i think i like, so my, my, when my mum started doing loads of JavaScript a couple of uh, last year or whatever, she got really into it with the uh, CodeCamp, and she just created loads of flowcharts, and it's actually quite, mm. it's quite a good way of doing it, like because mm. you're just, you know, you're seeing all the, you're basically just writing out exactly how your program should be, 
and then you've got it there and then it takes you you don't have to think about it that's what yeah. you're saying yeah and you just sort of you can concentrate on actually how to code it um yeah so i think so i think like, like that's good yeah like i i know what i want to do mm. it's just like the you know the syntax yeah that sounds like a really what, good start project though. what to type in is you know yeah yeah it's i from what i remember of like early days coding it was always a bit it's just like roadblocks that slow you down of mm. like oh god how do i actually do how do i implement this mm. thing you, like once you you have it in your head but then you have to look yeah. things up all the time and yeah kind exactly of get slowed down like you know make a button make a text box put a bit of writing that says roll roll dice i've got that and then it's like yeah. okay now i need the code that says take the number make make 10 individual instances of a random number and then put that out yeah yeah so i suppose like I, what i can remember from before is that you we used to do like an iterating something like iterate up to a certain number you'd like set a function that would like repeat itself x number of times yeah so generally with a with a for loop that was yeah back in uh I mean, it depends. You can make a function that. Uh, oh yeah, I mean, you probably always do it in a for loop. Um, yeah, I I would just create a function that would generate a random number between one and six. Yeah. And then, when you're and then you create like a another function that says. Um, roll dice or whatever, and then. Uh, as an argument for that, I'd pass in however many dice you want to roll, and then that number would become the become i in a for loop. Yes. You know, so that's uh, what I've done before. Yeah, that's what I remember from before was using. Max. Yeah, it was like i, and then for this number do i. Yeah. For, so. And yeah, then would but, that would that spit out a. So that would generate a, like your, a repeating set of results, right? Um, well, yeah, that would generate your six or ten or whatever random yeah. numbers between one and six, and then uh, I'd say, so, I mean, the way I would code it is functional code is programming, which is so I, I try to make everything as a pure function where you pass it in some arguments, and it's and it returns whatever you want, uh, which would be in this case would probably be an array of yeah. ten numbers. Yeah. Um, so and and not to use anything external. Uh, not not to use anything outside of that function. Just use what you pass in. Yes. And then and then spit something out. So yeah, I I do that and get your array and then. And then a way of displaying could, your results because yeah, you, you need to see your array. Yeah, you loop through your array and create some divs and. Yeah. Uh, basically, do a for loop with your divs as well, like for every for every. Um, so could that then? The array. Would that then write your div code in? Yeah, I mean, there's there's lots of ways of doing it, um, but I suppose if you're keeping it simple, just every time you want to do it, you want some container div with an ID or something, and you just clear it out. Well, instead of clearing it out, actually, you just do inner HTML equals, and then you generate your you generate the your, HTML. Yeah, generate your HTML. Yeah, okay. Um, that's one way of doing it. You could do it lots of other ways, really. Um, so things like React. Uh, they make um, things like removing items and adding items into the UI much easier uh, and they make it very efficient but that's a big kind of that's a big step you know, you've got a big library that yeah. you're using for this tiny thing so it's probably overkill um, so I think doing like uh, sticking with vanilla JavaScript for, for that dice app is probably uh, yeah like I want to sort of do it as simply as possible yeah yeah that's right that's, with like as little like amount idea. of stuff as possible yeah um just to sort of get something really easy going but like yeah th so this app this or this sort of web app can scale massively in complexity but you know like in, in terms of like making it viable you could just say right roll 10 dice and then i know if i'm using it for playing warhammer with Okay, I need three plus. Okay, it's giving me seven results that are three plus. Okay, now roll seven. And I can, you can right, kind of, okay. You can do it that way. 
but the better way to do it in the app would be like okay what's my to hit do i want it? you can like add layers onto it afterwards once you kind of got it working yeah if you can break it down into its constituent parts where each function is doing a small thing yeah um then it means you have the flexibility to kind of do more with it later you know build you know if you have your dice roll and your roll multiple dice thing then you can just do that have it many number of times you want to do on the next roll uh, according to the results you get back so you can still use those reuse those functions yeah um, yeah and whatnot. But yeah sounds sounds like a good plan good yeah and like adding animation for dice and stuff is like I don't like I'll do that's like later you know yeah, I just think you could do, you could do like a three D CSS dice. Well, that's yeah. I mean, there are apps, you know, like you know, mobile apps where you do, you just see all the dice get chucked into a box, and then it gives back. Yeah. You know. That'd be cool to do. I mean, three D CSS is. Uh, I've not really ever done any. It'd be quite nifty. Then my head went to like, could I just film? <laughs> You know, or like take pictures what? of each result and then just like put, oh, put, a, pic, put a picture up of each, you know? <laughs> yeah, I mean, fuck it. Just, I, mean, I think just whatever you fancy mm. doing when you're starting out with, with code. I wouldn't get try not to get slowed down by any decisions. Just no, and I, at it. I should find out more about the stuff at work as well over the next couple of weeks. Um, everyone's like yeah, been cool. on holiday and stuff, like all the tech guys been on holiday and my boss has been a hard day so but they've only they, apparently they've got three apprentices they've got three people available or they've got like three um, spaces that's yeah that's a bit uh a bit confusing so like does that mean you're so i don't uh, i'd have to i'd have to apply i have to i'll have to like apply basically okay so it's not guaranteed no okay so I've I've wanted to go and speak to um you know the like tech director and stuff and ask like what how many people did you have apply for this sort of last time you know mm. yeah if there's like five people apply or if there's like a hundred people you know it's like different or oh, it's th it's three for holiday extras yeah yeah so okay. they're gonna have three apprentices have they um have they kind of closed it off now. No, no, no. They haven't. The applications aren't open yet. Oh right. Okay. So they've barely given anything out. All they've said is, "We're going to do this." That's that's it. Uh, Basically, like all the people involved, put it out, and then all went on holiday. Right. I see. So it's like they had to sort of get it out before they went on holiday to give people time to think about it, and then they can actually sort of do it. Yeah. Over, over, over September, yeah. I think they they said they're due to start in November. Um, okay. And having looked at the maker's website, there's a cohort due to start on Beth's due date. Uh. <laughs> like the timing just could not be any worse. Oh dear. Well, I have to do an apprenticeship then. Um, do we, we want to do armory we first? We oh, you want to do graveyard? Okay, sure. Should we just yeah. check? Okay. Should be the best, right? Yeah, so at this point I think I'm fairly committed to doing it. Like, it's quite difficult to do it. To find lots of time to do it in the evenings, like... Well... Yeah, exactly. Yeah, an apprenticeship is perfect for that. So, um, yeah, I'm sort of like, I'm not going to bust myself if... Chances are I can get on an apprentice scheme. Okay. But, at the same time, I do want to have something to kind of bring to an interview, you know? Yeah. Yes. Can you resist it? 
I think it might have been for Pedro actually. In which case Pedro resisted but well. Tell me. Tell me everything. Tell me. Oh, I'm gonna get slept this time. Yeah. <laughs> Damn. Oh, where are my threat plates gone? <laughs> what the fuck? <laughs> you just disappeared. Oh, uh, just... They're just not... yeah. Not there at all. Um, just turn the top off. How oh, weird. Oh no, they are on. But they're not showing. That's uh, very odd. Ash reload? day. They were on when I was wandering around um, Beauty Bay earlier. Oh. That's a good time to have a look, I suppose. <laughs> She got the sleep off, that's annoying. I tried to like tab and interrupt. Oh, and it slips out. Yeah, I'll give you a sex load. Um, well, sorry, right, I'll. Uh, I don't know what the fuck to do. I might just reload the game. It's not really useful, is it? If you type slash. TP or whatever it is, does he bring up the menu? Is that what it is? No, it doesn't. Is that what it is? TP? I don't know. Uh, should be an interface option, shouldn't it? Threat plates. Yeah. TP, TP. <laughs> Always show nameplates. Oh, I think I pressed Alt V, which apparently. What the fuck? Alt V? No, it can't be that. I'm just gonna go down for a. down to the loop. Be right back. Okay. Oh, I think. I think one of the buttons. One of the shortcuts is one of my. uh. hotkey. 
thing. Oh, okay, so you accidentally turned it off. Yeah, yeah that's kind of annoying though. It's showing, I'm not showing still. Oh, yeah, they are. Okay, cool. Great. Sorted. Where are you now? You have a, oh, you're in cat form. Sneaky prawn. It's weird, like, yours go green when you've got aggro, yeah? Yeah, it'll, it'll do it based on your role, so... Ah, uh, okay, so how does it know that? Uh, your spec? Uh, yeah, it just knows, I guess it's got a mapping of specs to... Yeah, um, okay. ...behaviours. Yeah. yeah, I just noticed the colours are reversed. Um, if there are actually any... I had to use, um, well, I had to work out loads of stuff in Docker today, and it's really good actually. Like, it's really cool. Yeah, I like, we use Docker, I like Docker. Yeah, <clears throat> I just haven't really had to use it much, but I watched like a load of videos, like trying to fully understand what I was doing, and then I create like, um, what I called another one, <clears throat> and then I created a, like a dummy Next.js project to, to test everything out with it. Um, and uh, yeah, now I feel like I understand it all, which is nice. I don't do, know where um, the rare spawn. <laughs> yeah, they should be out here, but I don't see any again. No, no. Really around actually. Whoa, that was okay. Weird. I guess we can go back then. Should we, uh, should we kill the boss? We might as well kill Thanos if we're here. Yeah. Well, I suppose. Okay. Yeah, that's a good idea. I don't know what he drops. Is any use for us now? You might. You could get a blue. What? What's the blue? Um, What do you get from disenchanting it? Uh, some shards. Okay. But I don't know, I can't remember which. There.
What are you up to on your uh, tailoring, Ben? 201. 301. Oh no, it can't be 301. No, <laughs> Broken the system. Okay, that's, uh, that's pretty good, isn't it? It's like 40. Yeah, it's like perfect for our level actually. Nice. I've got my AOE trap down here, by the way. Oh, yeah. What's that? Oh. I don't need this one particularly, but I'll stick him, I'll stick him down. Yeah, I, nice. I, I only just got it, so... How much damage does it do? Um, it does... 100 to 130, and then 150 over time. So about 300-ish. Not too bad. For every, <coughs> every mob, yeah, that's pretty good. Yeah. Yeah, I've got a new mool and a new swipe, so it's uh, lovely. feeling much stronger. Yeah, you're doing noticeably more damage. Like this <coughs> AOE pulls, you're pretty much ahead of me, I think. remember where I got my current shoulders but they seem to be amazing compared to everything I see I don't understand uh, I think they might have been from Shadow Fan Keep which what is do you mental. have? I've got like these which are oh yeah I think they're a quest there must be a quest reward there's no minimum level on them I don't remember, but anyway, they're yeah. really good compared to everything I see. I can't think of a quest where I'd have got an item that would have been like similar power to that. Yeah, I can't remember a blue. I think like the last blue, blue crest. Crystal. Yeah, the last like blue crest was probably dead mines. Yeah, it definitely wasn't dead mines. one of the quests from... Oh, it was that Feralus one. Oh, okay, so it's fairly okay. recently, actually. Uh, we're skipping library. Yeah, let's try straight into armory. Oops. Oh, where are we going? Oh, I think we need to kill these. Otherwise we won't get through. We're in. Let's go. It's like oh, oh Ben. Oh, no, Ben's trapped. <laughs> Come in. Come in. It's open again, Ben. Just in the nick of the time. I love the. Uh, <laughs> it was always the uh, the horde fights with that door, wasn't it? Yeah. Someone had opened yeah. it, and like all oh, hell would break loose for five seconds. 
Someone would shut it again. <clears throat> You'd open it and there'd be like 15 orcs standing there. No, shut. <laughs> yeah. All winding up spells. Yeah. Oh, I see. <coughs> so he just popped out to chug a load of potions. <laughs> Thank Ooh. you. Backpedal, backpedal, backpedal. My new blessing of wisdom does 24 mana per 5 seconds. Quite strong. Nice. Quite a, uh... There we go. Oh, hyena. Oh, that's amazing. That's a good Yeah, that's kill, pretty good for you, isn't it? Absolutely fantastic. <laughs> what have you got at the moment? Um, a intellect and s stamina one. Oh, right, okay. <laughs> Blimey, yeah. That's awesome. <laughs> you got weapon damage on your... <laughs> yeah, I was just... Um, pop out and whack them. <laughs> Leveling up uh, enchanting. Yeah, no, I shouldn't say. Uh, we can just go straight to you, can't we? Well, no, no, I don't mean like pull everything. I meant just like not, not round the outside. <laughs> Thought you were gonna. No. <laughs> <laughs>
Baker. Yeah. Oh, sick. What's it there? Like that? <laughs> Large bear. <laughs> you fucking bastard! <laughs> <laughs> oh wait, 12, 12 slots? Haven't yeah. we all got 12 slots anyway? Oh no, we've got 10 slots, haven't we? Nice. Nice. Do you want to roll for it? Nah, that's right. You probably, uh, you could probably do with it. I've got to keep the stereotype up. What? Guys are doing a fair bit of damage. I think I should be able to make those bags very soon. Ah, nice. Are, are they mage weed ones, then, presumably? Must be. Yeah. Ooh. I think uh, I just need two oh, more tailoring levels. That's right. Got two more. Oh, hello there. Do you want me to bomb them? Yeah. And bank in here? See. I mean, I'm, I'm alright for mana, really. Okay. I could do it for you. So wish, though. I'll put a trap on the stairs. Oh. Hey, Herod, I wonder how we're going to. Um, <clears throat> I guess we've just got to just keep running away from him and hoping for the best. I'm not sure if any of us are going to hit him other than you, John. Uh, yeah. So it might be a case of like being up the top. Hitting him, if I get aggro, wait for him to run around the stairs, jump down, aspect of the cheetah, run away. Yeah. Yeah, if you can if you can just kite him forever. He runs really fast, I seem to remember that. Yeah. Uh, we'll have to see how we get on. You might have to maybe chill with the aggro initially. Yeah. See how it goes. <laughs> Guy healed himself! I know, that's <laughs> brilliant. <laughs> Not full health, I think I need topping up. <laughs> My mate's dead, nearly dead. Just amazing Expertly other guy. Programmed. That Just... proper paladin. Proper, he's definitely rolled yeah. the right character. He's got a hairstyle like we had on our paladins. <laughs> yeah.
hello. Oh. Yeah, it's boiling. Okay, I, I popped a trap down. Which one are we killing? Um. Protector. Sorry, I should say when I'm gonna. Was it screaming at you saying Rich needs Mark of the World? Carl was yeah. needs Mark of the World. <laughs> Honestly, it, 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 I it just does look like quite a buff, handy. A buff machine. <laughs> it's just there's always there's always an alert. It's, it's like yeah. more than fifty percent of the time. Oh mate, try and be paladin. Yeah, I can imagine. That's why Smart Buff was created. Was it? For, yeah, I mean, I can. It paladins. makes sense, really. I quite like the. Uh, it's like a little, uh, I don't know, like a menial task to do along with everything else, which I quite enjoy for some reason. <laughs> That's alright, he's going to heal himself. Oh, the grenades are too slow. I like the array of um, things we have to interrupt things now. Are they go how, what's the car speed of that then? Is that a one and a half seconds or something? Uh, it doesn't say on that the tooltip. That should be quick enough, shouldn't it? Yeah, it, it's like by the time I've like interrupted my shooting and stuff, it, yeah, it just... Are we leaving these other guys? Um, okay, I'm going to pop a... Oh shit, I popped a trap down. He's going to pull that guy on his own. <laughs> yeah, got him. <laughs> he comes running around the corner. I'm going to get that bear. He's like, oh shit. <laughs> <laughs>
have a quick heal before I start. <laughs> Still got my trap. Oh, it's <laughs> oh yeah, cool. <clears throat> it's gonna despawn now, isn't it? There we go. Oh. <laughs> <laughs> That's amazing. Yeah, like, cool, as she yeah. came up to it. Careful, <laughs> okay, don't pull those uh, mobs through the gate there, Tom. I, I just feign death. It'll be all right. I'm going to scatter next time she heals. Okay. <laughs> the other one's healing herself. <laughs> <laughs> if they healed each other, they'd be really difficult, but... Yeah. Like, I swear, like, some of the mobs, like the murlocs and stuff, are like level 10 or whatever, heal themselves. I heard the other ones, don't they? <laughs> yeah. Easy now we're level 34. Yeah. yeah. The new abilities. Oh, this is the room though, isn't it? With them. Yeah, yeah, this is where everything starts to get. <clears throat> so if they're are they two Myrodons? No, one. Watch out for the patrol. Do you want to pull them down yeah. into this room? A bit bigger. Yeah. Yeah. You may end up getting third. Oh no, that's good. Perfect. So, should we kill the defender first and leave the Myrodon to yeah. search away? I don't know, I'm not I sure think if that's so. a good idea or not. Yeah, well, it makes the... sense. It's just then we'll only deal with him in one of them enraged, we won't have to deal with the other guy as well. Because yeah. it's the enraged that's the main problem, right? Yeah, I mean, it, it still does a fair bit of damage um, when not enraged, but it's manageable. Yeah, should we practice? I mean, I don't know if it's <coughs> necessary, but maybe we should stun him at 30% and then just, just kite him while yeah. we finish him off. Who's going to stun? Uh, I can stun him if you want. Okay. Well, that's assuming it hits. Probably the best tactic. Nice. <coughs> you can pop out and do a star fire. <laughs> Resist. <laughs> yeah, that's true. <laughs> I might try and do that. So, what's the patrol here? Is it that? Oh, right. was it? I think there's a patrol here. Maybe not. Yeah, there, oh, is, yeah, there, there is. is. Yeah. Okay. It's going to be a big. Oh shit! It's pulled. Oh, oh dear. Okay. Shall we? What have we got? We've got. This. Let's get the evoker. Kill the tough okay. One. Do, you, do you want to bring him down here? Yep. Yeah. Around the corner. Don't worry, I'm just going to kill the evoker. Okay. Oh, we've got four. Yeah. Okay. Yeah. Def one of the defenders next. Yep. Yeah. One, 
Get ready. Uh, I'm good for mana at the moment, so. Yep. Yeah. I've got grenades. Take the other defender. Mm -hmm. oh, sorry. Who's going to stun? I'll, I'll do it. I'm just a okay. If it doesn't work, I'll scatter. <laughs> oh, it worked. That's the first time I've seen you use Wrath in about <laughs> 20 levels. <laughs> it's nice. That was good. Yeah. How many was that? That was four, was it? Three defenders. Okay, so it's random. I thought it was always the same combinations. No, it's always had... a mix. Yeah. Bring them down, shall I? <laughs> Try to kick my minor mana roll. Yeah. Uh, that, angry. yeah, that trap on the pool isn't great, is it? Because it aggroes them. <laughs> yeah, it's yeah. right sometimes. It depends if I miss the first few. I'll scatter. That's what... I'll get the next one. Uh, 
Uh, I've got no hammer of justice, so can you bash and then run? Yep. Have you got it back? No, it's I've 30 got, seconds. I've got scattered. But my seal of okay. justice is stuck, just uh, dropped, so. <laughs> oh. So when you throw grenades, like it's Warcraft so glitchy, you always throw it where they are, and it always hits them, like the, oh. no matter where they run. <laughs> oh really? <laughs> I remember that being the case. Yeah. Ah. Oh. No, I was trying to get it where he was going, and then yeah, you stopped don't him. Yeah. Don't anticipate. You just yeah. right at them. <laughs> <laughs> it's quite a big blast on this one, though. On the bronze, yeah, the bronze yeah. bomb. I think another one. Yeah. yeah. The iron's quite small, isn't it? I think. Yeah. Pedro emerges with three more mobs. <laughs> <laughs> oh, jeez, right. Let's get this one. The thing is, it's like, I might as well leave him, because, like, yeah. the mob will pull him anyway, you know? Oh, it's so much easier than last time. Mm. Yeah, um, it is. Yeah, it's nice fireworks. They've got the red rockets here, haven't they? Oh, yeah. Four of them. Whoa, 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 why can't I hear you? Oh, you're over there. No. Shit. This is going badly. Come on! Oh! Fucking hell. Jesus. No, we're done. This is on 52. Should we take that? Yeah. You stun it, Rich. Uh, 
back. Take the defender. Indeed. That was close. Yeah, good job. Um, yeah, good, good healing. Those um, uh, casters, I can pretty much just nuke them myself. Like you can kind of leave them if they're like okay. off in the distance. Yeah. That's a good point. scatter when she enrages. Need any um, mana potions? Uh, no, that's right, I've got loads. And I've got ten. I've been using them a bit more liberally this run because it's like. Well, have you got greater ones? Or... I've got the ones you sent me. Um, yeah, greater. Cool. I've used all my small ones now. Yeah, you might as well smash them because they they drop in the in the chests all the time. It's funny, isn't it? You feel like if you were trying to like do a looking for group on this, we'd all get rejected. Maybe apart from you, Rich, for being too low level. I think people are a lot more open-minded now in this game, though. Yeah. Do you remember how, like, as a druid, if you tried to tank, a lot of people would have just said no. Yeah. Like early days. Which is funny because they're so much better as tanks at this level than they are as healers. Yeah. Like I, I didn't really it's like just... leveling as a, like healing sort of while leveling up because I felt like I just didn't have enough spells. It was like a slow yeah. healing touch or a regrowth that just used loads of mana. There, there were all these tropes like that people used to spell in the early days because they just heard them if someone else say them you know mm. like, you know whatever like can't do this or if someone can't do that that's what I loved about my um I said loads of times but like epic was really good like it let you try wacky things out in the guild it's just like the first time I experienced that yeah, mine was my guild was much more like down the line. Okay, I'm I gonna... think most guilds were really. They were like 
Everyone should be like this. I really want to see. I don't know if it's actually possible to find it anymore, but the Unixia footage with that guy who goes mental. <laughs> I'm, like, sure. More dots, more dots. I'm sure that is on YouTube. Well, there's, I know the sound bit is, and someone's done like drawings all over it. Um, you know, like when they say more dots, just people are just, it's just someone drawing dots all over the screen. Um, but I don't know if the actual <laughs> Unixia footage is on. Oh, I see. Yeah, um, I don't know. That would be so good. Maybe it's not even available. Maybe there was never a video of that. How long does that last? Is that 30 seconds? Uh, yeah. It's pretty good. Yeah, it's pretty good. Still got marbles to use. Yeah, me yeah. too. We might be using them on this boss. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> to be honest, I think you'll spend most of the time watching him spin around in circles. And then, uh, and then he go, he gets berserk, doesn't he? Yep. He's like a giant myrmidon. <laughs> yeah. Oh, he's just got a massive axe, though, isn't he? I really want you to get that axe. It, that'll be the first time any of my characters have ed ever got <laughs> the axe, and I'll use it fairly liberally. I can assure you. Oh. 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 Nice. Uh. Well, yeah. I mean, that's not terrible for you, Ben. No, it's pretty good. Is that? I mean, it's not like amazing. It's more one to sell, really, isn't it? But our auction house doesn't, doesn't really uh, allow for that. Um, 25 in this instance, it's a bit weird. Yeah, I'll take it, why not? You may as well, even if you disenchant it, there's, not, there's nothing else I think to do. it's uh, worth it. I should I should balance out this spec a bit with, with a bit of stamina. Okay. And it has, strength, it has a bit of strength on it anyway, so it's pretty good. Yeah. Laid a freezing trap down. Oh, um, cool. Just for when we need it. Yeah, missed it. funny on the traps aren't they it's like you need to kind of get them straight off yeah we just need to be uh, aware of the timer of it Can you set them with a feign death as well no uh. I don't think so no because the pet keeps me in combat ah uh, right of course I've got no stun
<laughs> He's really angry now. <laughs> yeah. He's fucking rattling me. Right. All right. This should be entertaining. Uh, yeah, so I guess we're just going to have to try and... I think just let Ben get some aggro and see, yeah. see how we go. Um, Up and down, I guess. Yeah. <clears throat> yeah, when he does very blades of light, I think if we just, if we scatter fairly well, then none of us should get hit by it. Should we save some of the bag of marbles for when he enrages? I could use... Yeah, I could do if you I want. I could use mine. But have you both got yours, then? Yeah, I've got, I've got, I've got five, yeah. Okay. Um, yeah, can do. I think if we can just see if we can survive easily for a while, then we could just work on strategy while we're killing him. Have might, please. Yes. He doesn't do nature damage, does he? You gave me those nature potions. No, no he just does giant axe damage. <laughs> 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 Physical. Yeah, so I don't think he does any spells, does he? No. He usually stand here, but actually. Oh, oh, yeah, he's level 40, isn't he? Yeah, okay. Okay. Ready? Yeah. Where should uh, I. Where do you want me to tank him? So tank those? him in the middle down the bottom. Yeah. Um, but then just be ready to run up the stairs when he starts doing the blades of light. Or just run yeah. away, I guess. Okay. Um, yeah, I guess we'll just try and. I bet I get. Healing aggro, you're gonna to struggle to hit him, aren't you? Leroy! <laughs> <laughs> Do you think Pedro's gonna survive this? I oh, absolutely not. There's not a whirlwind chance. coming in three seconds. Oh, oh shit. he's after me. That's kinda of good. Yeah, so so he's immune. No, it took it away. Is he immune? He is immune, isn't he? John is dead, he's got aggro. Well, that was a big old hit. Yeah, I haven't got enough. Is that yet. John, John, you got aggro, yeah. <laughs> and it works all right though, because yeah, <laughs> except Pedro's getting it fucked. <laughs> 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 Look at him go. I'll give, I'll give Ed Pedro a few heals. Oh, oh, fucking out, yeah, careful. Feel myself instead of you. So I think since I uh My camera keeps going behind this pit like the flags. <laughs> Anticlimax. <laughs> <laughs> I thought this might be the case. I thought his spin. I remember his spin being ridiculous. There we go. Okay, I think his spin has got rid of my bag of marbles. Uh, shouldn't have. Shouldn't, he's still got my shit of light on. I don't see the buff. Fuck. All this enrages. This enrage hits hard. Yeah. I can now still enraged then, so he's just perma enraged. Yeah, I think so. He's really pissed off. I'm gonna try and get a demoralizing shout on him. There we go, finally. Of 
ads come, right? Yeah, so this, this will group up in the middle, yeah. Strength stem. Yeah. Mind you, it's got 1% crit. I can do a big AoE uh, like challenging that. brawl. But then I've got, like, a male uh, item. It's <laughs> very really slow. Yeah. Oh, I can't. I can't do it with this. <laughs> they all die really quick. Nice. Um. Yeah, I mean that's like. <clears throat> so yeah, one percent is that crit critical strike? Is that for? So you reckon you can use that? Um, starting, starting strength is completely pointless for you, isn't it? Yeah, no, I'm just trying to work out what 1% crit means. I don't no, think it's very good. Any good. No, I've got the trip run on Grease from Nomergun. Um, okay. Um, I don't actually have a male head. So oh, I'm yeah, take it. Nice. Although I can't Weiss. use it for. Oh, no, wait, I can use it soon. Two levels. Cool. Well, oh well, it wasn't the axe, but you know, there we go. <laughs> that was easier than I thought it was going to be. <laughs> yeah. yeah, yeah, it wasn't too bad. Well, I mean, we could try cathedral. I mean, it would be uh, the level slow going. Forty-two. Yeah, I, I mean, the mobs are. We're not better off doing this again. We probably are better off doing this again. Just um, um, try yeah. and get you the axe. Yeah, because uh, keep forgetting the yeah, axe. You guys are still. It there. did say the um. It said the entry level was 35. Really? For a cathedral? Mm -hmm. Actually, there's no... No, it would be... There's no minimum... Like, Scarlet Monastery is the same, I think, for minimum. Or is that... Maybe that was the advised... It, it was on minimum. that list that I posted in the um, WhatsApp group it had. Yeah, but they're advised levels for each one. Yeah, the advised levels. Yeah. Some yeah. Spoons. 30, 35 to 39, I think it was. Yeah. Um, There's respawns at the bottom of here. Yeah. Uh, we can try and go invisible and see how far we get. Oops. Didn't actually mean to do that. Oh shit! <laughs> <laughs> Did you just I just didn't expect them to be there. <laughs> I thought we, uh, I thought we pulled them just now. There. No. I'm bringing it back down.
gonna respawn there. We're barely at oh I suppose we are a little bit back. Yeah, this is all full. Disarm my polo on though, not my bow. Probably when we get to the courtyard, maybe we could invis through. Yeah, otherwise um, I'm gonna have to go for, for ammo. Yeah, okay. Um, I brought two bags full. I've got most of a bag left. Okay. I mean, we could just hearth and... Come back. Well, what, what happens if we leave the instance? Do we go to South Shore? Or do we go back to our hearthstone location? Yeah, we'll go back uh, to our... In whatever inn. We go to our inn, yeah. Uh, mine's yeah. Booty Bay. It's, Same. It's probably quicker just to just to take your gear off at suicide. <laughs> oh, that's a good idea. <laughs> yeah, I suppose it, that's doable. Have you got enough space to do for that? that? Oh, I've got loads here. Uh... Yeah, I've got enough. Um, okay. Should we do that then? Yeah. Let's mm -hmm. <laughs> get naked. Naked. <laughs> <laughs> you don't need to take cloaks off and rings and yeah. neck. I could keep my cloak on. That makes me look even better. <laughs> <laughs> right, well, I'm gonna um, I'm gonna use make use of this invisible potion. I've only got one left. I'm sorry, I can't give you one. <laughs> I'm gonna see how far I get. Ow. <laughs> Oh, this has worked really well. Oh, now I'm in trouble. Took one for the team. <laughs> are you actually dead, or have you? Are you pretend dead right now, John? No. Oh no, I'm actually dead. <laughs> oh, I so nearly made it. Oh, <laughs> at the entrance. <laughs> that was weird because I died at the same instant that I pressed feign death. <laughs> Did they see through your uh, I must your have, charade? Yeah. <laughs> He's not really dead. Oh, no, well, it didn't go on. It, it, it didn't. Go, it didn't go on cooldown, so they must have got me just before. Ah. Uh, oh well. What level the? Which I think some of their mobs are off level forty actually. So I guess um, thirty six would be best to do that. Maybe yeah. we could do it thirty five. I don't know. Right, so we need to go out and I'll reset. Oh, oh shit, Rich, yeah. you're so close. Yeah, I know. Bloody annoying. Are you all, all out? Yeah. Oh wait, I'm not. I'm not leader. Yeah, I'll do it. Okay, reset. Right. 
well. A few reckless balls are in order. <laughs> I didn't use my explosive sheep either. Uh, uh, I'm gonna give it a try. You <laughs> should have used on Herod. Yeah, I know. Blaze of light! comes. <laughs> yes. <laughs> Look at it go. That was great. I didn't realise it was so slow. I've only, got, th along. <laughs> only got three left. I'm going to save it for bosses. <laughs> oh dear. They don't kick, do they, at least? Oh, crikey. There's a caster in there somewhere, isn't there? Yeah, I'm just, just winding him up. I'm just going to kill him. <laughs> uh, which one are we killing, by the way? Any. If I can just get enough for one holy light, I've got it in three months. So. Do you want any <clears throat> healing pots? No, I got 20. Uh, I haven't been using them actually, I should probably start using them, but I have to come out of bear to use them, so it's a bit dodgy. Yeah. Actually, so soon you'll be able to use superior ones. Mm. 
Yeah, when can I use those? Those are <coughs> level 35. 35. Oh yeah, I'm on 98%, so I can use them very soon. Nice. Oh, Pedro, what have you done? <laughs> I've really gone for it. Pe Pedro beelined <laughs> across the... You know where, like, they do something and by the time... Oh, I've... I don't go past me, I'm going to get kicked. I've clicked the button. Oh, no. He's already halfway there. <laughs> Fuck off. Go okay, back to... Sorry, it's a skull. It's all the nameplates. Um, can you throw a grenade and do a do a heal and Ben do a heal? Yeah. Okay. Yeah. Coming. It's coming. Go. Nice. Congratulations. The, the oh. nice final talents now. Heart of the Wild. Three. Mm -hmm. I've just gone to my um, holy crit talents, so I've got five plus five holy crit to come. Be nice. I don't know what are your what are your final ones in marks? Um one percent extra damage on ranged weapons. So it will just be five percent more damage. Yeah, I can see that. Um, is that pretty nice for you, Ben? No, I've got some strength yeah. rings. I'd rather have. Uh, John, do you want that? Nope. No. I've got okay. Add, got add you in my rings. It's actually no use for me, really. I mean, I suppose. I suppose it's better than a six-inch one. I don't know. I don't really care about stem. Uh, do you want to wait up here and I'll bring them up? Yeah. Hey, Vem, how many are you bringing? <laughs> many. There's, there's a few. <laughs> The one that's chasing after John. <laughs> Who's gonna stun the protect I next? I got it. Stun him next. Oh dear. Uh, oh, nice. <laughs> nice. Oh man, he's still alive. Yeah, he healed himself. He managed to get a heal, yeah. Oh no, we needed that. We needed that grenade, because you're going to have to heal yourself again. 40 seconds. <laughs> Can you put a slow? No, you can't put a slow. Nope. Um, this might be healing pot time. I'm out of mana. Can you stun one of these? Uh, no. <laughs> Just 
slow regrow. <laughs> Stun one, I can stun the next guy if you can. Down. That's just one guy. <laughs> it's quite funny seeing you running away drinking a potion. <laughs> yeah. I tried to go into cat and sprint up here, but I didn't have any mana left, so I was like, oh. <laughs> <laughs> I've got a trap right behind you, by the way. Oh. <laughs> He's run off now. Guy's got stuns. Uh, yeah. Uh, I've got a charge. Okay. I did next next one. Okay, I'll scatter the next if there is one. I've just gone to bed, so if Ezra wakes up, I'm gonna have to go and see him, I'm afraid. That's okay. No worries. We're on a bit of a run of really good bedtimes recently. Oh, yeah? Yeah, she's just been going down without much fuss. Which is nice. I were out before and put on a treadmill or something. Oh, wow, well, yeah. That's kind of what you have to do. Yeah. Come on, we're going out on the bike at like four o'clock. Oh, in the morning? No. <laughs> <laughs> oh, you, did, you thought I was serious? Sometimes she does wake up and she goes, Is it night time or daytime? And it's like half six, and we go, It's, it's night time. Okay. She tries to, back, tries, to go, tries to go back to sleep, but then she can't for some reason. Yes, yes, yes. Oh, that's very good behaviour. Henry would never accept anything but <laughs> waking up. Yeah. Oh, boss. Forgot to uh, stand. quite hard to choose boys names though yeah it's much much more difficult I think yeah 
Mate, yeah, it's been much more difficult. <laughs> I love this AI on these. It's just like, he sees his mate running off in fear. Just hear myself. <laughs> it's like that Ralph, Ralph Wiggum meme, I'm in trouble, you know? Yeah. Oh, I'm in danger, whatever. Um, yeah, yeah. Just healing himself. It's just the fact they do it at max health. Yeah. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> yeah, I don't know why I thought they bubbled. They, they don't. It must be the. I think I must be thinking of the strat. Yeah. Uh, living side. Oh shit, I'm actually quite low on mana. Uh, I can grenade, you know, let's kill this one. Oh, should be right, I think. Okay. I can uh, probably get a heal off the two of them. Two. Okay. That's a strange strategy that I'd never seen or considered. Just popping out bare potting and then going back in. But it's quite effective. It's a good idea. Yeah, might as well use them up. This guy's got quite a lot of armor on them. He's got any kind of arm oh, actually that's one thing we miss, is any kind of sundering or yeah. armor exposing. You don't get anything like very fire. Oh. oh, yeah, see, yeah, of course. So we do. Is that an actual flare? Did you buy a flare? <laughs> I did, yeah. <laughs> Come in useful finding all those panthers in the uh, Strangler form channel. Just wait till we get to Dime All East. Oh, yeah, that's true. I said I'm alright though, I've got perception. <laughs> <laughs> They're invisible though, aren't they? So perception won't work. Uh, well, Flare doesn't un unhide invisible mobs. Uh, uh, yeah, Pretty hidden sure. hidden and invisible enemies. Is it really? Yeah. I thought, are you, sh are you sure? Because I thought only warlocks could see invisibility. Yeah, that's what it says. Hidden and invisible. Oh wow, they must have... Um, I don't know if they changed that. I have no idea actually. I suppose it's pretty useless if it's not invisible. Yeah, in PvE, yeah. I thought Warlocks were the only ones that could do invisible, uh spot invisibility. I mean, it's only in like the, you know, the AOE of the flare. Yeah. So it's, the Warlock is like detect, kind of isn't it? Well, it's very handy, very specific circumstances. Main thing is it looks quite nice. Yeah. 
Okay. <laughs> Stock up again, see? Ooh. <laughs> 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 it's even more. Oh shit. Is it three members? How many we got? Three. Yeah. Okay, I'm taking Vance target. Oh, we are killing the Mimodon first. It's three Mimodons. Okay. Oh, of course it is. Are you going to Hammer of Justice? Yeah. Mm -hmm. Oh, you went out of range for a heal. There's some mobs around the corner as well. Oh, no, they're not. Awesome. I'll stun this oh. one. Okay. Did you miss? Yeah. Okay, scatter. I'll wing clip him. So there's Hammer of Justice back. Mamadons are no match for us. But funnily, like, like things, so much has changed since yesterday. Like, two Mamadons were, were way too much for us yesterday. Yeah. for five seconds and decided that was enough. Be nice to see a star fire. I'll do that next time. <laughs> <laughs> I did. I tried twice and they both resisted. I was like really annoyed. <laughs> resisted the trap. Bastards. It's loads of mana that trap as well. Are we getting the? Which one are we getting? Sorry. Protector. <clears throat> protector of himself. <laughs> yeah, so protector.
Oh dear. As was waking up. Oh yeah. Yeah, no worries. Thank. You probably got the threat on these. You could just go if you want. Yeah, I think I'll probably have to. Otherwise, that's just right. wake everyone else up. Yeah, that's okay. Yeah, no worries. Yeah, go for it. Um, I probably won't be back in time for us to continue much, so you might as well hearth after this. Yeah, okay. Okay, okay. no problem. Um, it's, it's been fun. Right. Yeah. Yeah, good Catch run. Catch you guys later. Yeah, alright. Yeah, See cool. Ya. Catch you later. Yeah, that was much easier than I uh, expected it to be, to be honest. Yeah. Yeah. It's amazing what a difference, like, just hitting over, like, a certain kind of level threshold. Yeah, it's kind of... <clears throat> I mean, it's nice to, to have the challenge of, like, facing red mobs, but they're just annoying, aren't they? They're just hard yeah. to hit. Well, it's just so slow that it's, like... Yeah. You can kind of grind your way through it and do it, but, like... It just becomes a very slow way of levelling up. Mm. I love that Ben's still got the threat. <laughs> Take him. <laughs> Watch on a try. Yeah, Get into my tanking gear. It's gonna be terrible. I've <laughs> basically lost 1,000 mana or something. Well, yeah, I'm just gonna pull threat off you immediately as well. You might as well stay in the healing yeah. gear. <laughs> Mind you, then Let's again, see. Pedro just could. You, maybe Pedro could tank. Yeah, try and kite them. Try and kite them. I'll do. Yeah. No My damage is really bad if I'm kiting, that's the only trouble. Oh, I see, yeah. Um, I'll pop a trap down here and we'll send Pedro and just see if Pedro can survive. <laughs> okay, here we go. Okay. I'm gonna put him kind of around the corner. Okay, which one are we killing? That one. Uh, Pedro's got it. I'll see the light. We'll uh, help him out a bit. I'm gonna get aggro here, aren't I? <laughs> Go on, Pedro. I'll put a light on this guy. Okay. So I'm like too slow, really. Right, I'm gonna feign. I resisted. <laughs> really made him angry. Dazed. Oh, stun. Fantastic. Done. I mean, Pedro's done more damage than I have. <laughs> oh, now, now they're angry. Oh, they're both angry. <laughs> Splendid. Oh my god. Oh, Pedro's down. Oh, they're coming. <laughs> Fucking hell. Thank you. Oh, what are they doing? It. I don't know. They probably don't know what to do. They're both the oh, they're killing Ben! <laughs> the only two people left in combat. Both bopped and... Uh, wait a minute, you better run over here. Oh, you... Oh, <laughs> oh no, he got me. <laughs> oh, I think I, I managed to crit him with that... Uh... Oh, mate, I reckon I can... Uh... Can you do it? Okay, um, definitely. So Pedro did more damage than I did. I, I probably should have switched Pedro to the other one. <laughs> yeah, I can kite these indefinitely. 
Oh, wait, the other one's a bit faster now. I need to get him down. I'll see if I can run in the entrance. Yeah, the other one's down to 7%, so he's pretty much walking around. <laughs> There's two mobs still here. Better not put them. Oh no, I think I'm gonna... I'm about to come back in, if you can get to the entrance. Okay, well I've got some some mobs here for you. Oh no, what have I done? Oh, I'm dazed. Come on, come on. <laughs> yes. Well, I mean, I, I caused myself some trouble there. Oh, they're, they're berserks actually uh, run away. Oh, no. oh, we've got another respawn, have we? Yeah. Okay, oh, should we run out? Yeah. <laughs> nice. Ten. That was smooth. <laughs> <laughs> yeah. That was brilliant. I'm kiting them both round on like 15%, and they're running the same speed as me. Lovely jubbly. Right, I'll probably log, I think. Yeah, I was going to sell my bits and then uh, log also. It's actually nice to finish before 11. Yeah, I have to say, I was probably going to say, once we'd finished Herod again, I was going to log anyway, I think. Oh, yeah, I've I been, should, I've been that was going to be the last bit. staying up quite late, and I've got Eleanor all day tomorrow. It's quite hard to look after all day when you're knackered, you know. Yeah. Oh, well, I got a helmet out of it. Yeah. Bonds up. Um, I don't know what we should be doing next. I could just do some quests, to be honest. Oh, yeah, we should need to get your... We could do the bow. Uh, bow. That yeah. should be the next job. Yeah, we, we should do, do all the Stranglethorn um, quests. Get, and then we can get us all up to 35, 36. That'd be perfect. Yeah, we'll just go and get my first aid manuals. Lovely. Yeah, I feel like maybe we should do some questing in Stranglethorn. Yeah. Bit of a change of pace. Oh, I'm level 35, so everything's opened up now. We can get, we can go all the way to 300 with all our abilities, with all our professions and whatnot. So if you get your first aid to... Well, I suppose you don't really use it, do you? First aid? Yeah. Not very much. What about... when well, you don't care about cooking or fishing? No, I, di so, I didn't know you could get so much stuff from fishing, though. I didn't know you could like, did fish I, out really? greens and stuff like you've been yeah. doing. No, I didn't realise it was quite as good as it was. Um, it's just a good, it's good money maker. Even if, uh, even with our shit at auction house, I like just vendoring all those greens is pretty mm. good money. <sighs> well, yeah, you have to choose a, uh, a type of engineering, wouldn't you? Seem. Yeah, yeah, yeah. I'm not sure. I feel like Goblin might be the way to go, just to add more, like, damage stuff. Yeah, you, if you get the the rocket helm, it could be quite nice. Yeah, exactly. I don't know 
what other goblin? It's the boots, isn't it? But then they just send, they just send you running around all over the place. Yeah, they? it's pointless. But the rocket helmet is like a really good long CC. Yeah. There's a mind control cap as well, I guess, but... Yeah. I might go and do my 300 fish the first day. Rest now. Oh, for fuck's sake, I need one more mage weave. Oh, I've got laugh. I've got one in my bag. It probably wouldn't be enough anyway. Uh, the first aid vendor's in S Stromgard, right? Am I remembering that right? Yes. Yeah, it's just... Um... It's like yeah, to the left I... when you go in. Uh, right. Right, okay. Don't go left because there's loads of mobs there. Mm. Oh, he got a twelve stop bag as well, didn't he? Mm. Yeah. I think Ben should be able to make all those soon anyway. Yeah. Yeah, I didn't really get many items. Like not a lot of like junk in that run. I had loads of loads of bag yeah. space left. Oh, wait, that's the problem with Scarlet Monster, if you're not killing any bosses, are we? We're killed Herod, that's it. Once. Yeah. Yeah, uh, Race Vent Downs has a couple of things that I really like. Or well, one at least, Lady Saw something. Uh, yeah, we should go and do that. I'd like to get you the axe from Herod. Once I've got that, I don't need to keep doing them again and again. <laughs> yeah, that'd be pretty funny. What is Oh, yeah, Loxy drops that. Um, that. Uh, Staff, mm. a blue staff, which is pretty good. Like 60 attack power against beasts. Yeah, it's good for like. What can I do? That would have been perfect yeah. before Stranglethorn there. Yeah, yeah. yeah. Or, or you actually, I think it's just generic. Yeah, it's it is. Like, yeah. What's your. Uh... What weapon? I used to have a pole arm. Yeah, yeah, a pole arm with eleven agility on it. Ah, okay. Yeah, even the rewards for uh, Scarlet Monastery for that Scarlet Monastery quest, mm. like all weird. They're all like just warrior. I guess they just themed they just themed the loot off based off the bosses, don't they? So it's like Doan is a mage and then Herod's a warrior. And then the For other the one quest is like reward, you would have thought they'd get, you know, they'd give a bit of a variety, but it's like strength yeah. one hander or two hander, yeah. a rogue dagger or a mage offhand, I think. Like a frost damage yeah. offhand. It's a bit odd. The, the two hand is really good though, it's like 20 strength. I wouldn't mind getting that. It's also like 40 DPS or something. That's pretty good. It's like twice what mine is. Mm. Yeah, I only just got this corpse maker thing and it just does 28. <laughs> well, Pedro's been much uh, less calamitous than Susan has. <laughs> <laughs> yeah. 
Yeah, I don't know whether it's just like the flappy bird just looks a bit unwieldy. Yeah. <laughs> that fucking screech as well. Uh, yeah, I think at that point I was like, I can't, I can't play with that. <laughs> yeah, that was the uh, <laughs> straw that broke the damage back. <laughs> right, I'm out to here. Uh, I'm, You're I'm, out of here, season. If I want to tame a a uh, turtle, I'm gonna have to let Susan go. <laughs> I wouldn't mind seeing um, a gorilla actually. <laughs> they make like, they're really quiet, kind of. Kind of um, I don't even they know. They do like the thun They do the thunderclap. Oh yeah. It's just when they attack, they just sound kind of like not that. They're not very aggressive sounding. No, they kind of grunt. Yeah. Yes, where's that? Is the weapon from killing Bangladesh? Yes. Is that the quest reward? Okay. Yes. And then later on, I guess you might want to actually tame Bangladesh, but you've got to wait till. Yeah, I don't. Three, I don't know if he is any different to just like a level forty-three cat. Like it doesn't. Uh, I don't think he has yeah, any special is. abilities or anything. Uh, I assume it's just really fast attack speed or something. Yeah, there's one. There's broken teeth, which spawns. In like the Badlands, which everyone always wants to get, um, which has a 1.0 attack speed. Oh yeah, that's, that's pretty mental. But that's like a PvP thing, you know. It's like about the kind of interrupts more than it is the actual damage. Yeah. Oh, I can use less of stuff. It's level 35 now. Got a trinket. Where do you get um, like <coughs> uh, I don't know what the fuck you call it reagent vendors? Where's reagent vendor in um, store? You uh, know, it's by you know when you come in from Elwyn, it's mm. like on the left, like oh, it's the guy. Okay, see, so yeah. we do the wine quest. Yeah. When you're like level six or whatever, it's that that shop there. Flask of oil and make some jumper cables, and then I'm going to log off. Make these fishies.
your giant eggs which you can't get until like level 40 or something. Mm. Around yeah, I'm definitely, I'm definitely, like you said earlier, I'm definitely seeing more. Mm -hmm. I mean, it, it's gone from like five to like twenty. <laughs> for yeah. the whole server. There's now I can see what, four people in Stormwind. Yeah. I'm the, I'm the only hunter on the server. One one druid, one hunter, two mages, <laughs> four paladins. James Hardcore guy is still. Who's going? going? Level 39 now. Yeah. <laughs> Just go and fuck him up. <laughs> <laughs> Arrive with a load of gorillas or something. Just walk behind him, healing him. <laughs> He's a nice bloke. Yeah. I wonder what, um, presumably. Oh no, there's two of them in Mortal. Oh, well, that Clissor guy was around before as well. Yeah, I quite like. I still quite like the idea of the hardcore mode. It's just like uh, on your own, sat on your own, like without anyone to talk to. It gets quite dull. Yeah, I just get, I couldn't deal with just questing all the time. Yeah, see, I quite like questing. It's it's I probably like it my like preferred way to level in some ways, but. With multiple people, it gets a bit like I, I like solo questing. I think. Yeah, I, no, I don't mind solo questing, but I, uh, after a while, it gets boring. Yeah. It's just like instances are a bit more dynamic. Yeah, like running the instances with three of us has been good fun. And uh, but and like the questing just feels a bit like. I don't know. It's like too easy. And also, kind of, you got you know, like collect stuff. You got to collect like so many things. Yeah. Yeah, that's why I'm looking forward to doing all those strength or veil. It's, it's got an, it's a nice goal as well at the end of that. Mm. Um, but uh, like just kill quests are nice and simple. Yes. Although there is a lot of killing to be done, I suppose we've got three, not basically nine quests, what, well, ten quests in total to do, haven't we? Yeah, yeah, but with three of us it's so fast. Yeah. Yeah, I guess with solo questing I really, I quite enjoy trying to like look and optimise a route and then also optimise the kind of the gameplay in terms mm -hmm. of like trying to keep going without drinking, without stopping, like using the most yeah. sort of efficient mana spells yeah. and stuff, you know? Yeah, it's definitely the fun bit of uh, solo play. You've got nothing else to think about, really, have you? Yeah. You might as well. <laughs> cool. Made me fish. Oh, I'm going to look there. Yeah, alright. I'll, uh... I'll... I don't know, we Was it Sunday? Yeah, Sunday seems like quite a good day. All round. Yeah. I, I certainly won't play until Sunday. No, well, we, I don't think we ever really do. No. Any other days other than? I've got a um, Warhammer game with Stuart Saturday evening next week. I've got stuff to paint for it, so. Okay. Um, yeah, I might just do the one wow session and see how my painting goes. Yeah, I don't really mind too much. Uh, right, cool. Alright. I am going to go to bed. Okay. See you next time then. Yep. Catch you there. Bye. Bye.
do for you? Safe travel.
my attention. Good. 